Alright, sorry for the janky ass video right now. So, I was completely unprepared for this video. So, when I showed up to work, I thought I had my tripod. I had, thought I had my... But I thought I had my... Whatever you call it, the adapter you can attach your phone to a tripod to. I thought I had that. Didn't have that. I had this tripod right here that I use for like filming if I can't do with my grill upon the gym I do this yeah well it didn't really work if I don't have my phone adapter so I have this right here where it is right now like literally leaning on one of my tripods I try putting my aqua jug up there <laughs> it ain't fit so but let me get to the video so I know a lot of you guys when it comes to getting a strong masculine physique while it's in the top like things that guys want it's going to be big arms my problem I see in the gym all the time is that guys are doing the wrong exercises for building arms. And in fact, you're wasting your goddamn time in the gym. And you know me, I want you to maximize your time in the gym. I don't need you to spend hours in the gym. I just need you to spend a little bit of time and then you're going to get there. Guys, in today's video, I'll be going over the two top exercises to build your arms. They're not going to be curls. They're not going to be push downs. Those are wasting your time. And in fact, I'm be going over why those are better. So if that sounds good, give me one of these. Come on, guys, give me one of these. And also, subscribe more content coming soon. And let's get into it. What's going on, guys? It's your man, Eric, of the same lifestyle. And today's video is going to be all about those two exercises to help you guys blow up your arm gains. Okay, right now, it is super freaking cold in Denver. About damn time. And... I'll just show you right now. Well, it was snow, but my windshield's a bit warm now. And this right here, yes, I'm literally propping my phone up on that. So, <laughs> I also forgot my camera at home because I'm a numb thong. Well, so guys, these two exercises are not going to be the bicep curl, the tricep push down at all. Like I said, those are wasting your time. If you want to maximize your time in the gym, which our gym is now, you can only spend an hour, so. If you're wasting time, that's gonna suck. And it's just going to waste your energy too. So guys, here are the exercises I use for my clients. I've actually shown significant results. Now a little back history on me. Why I started doing chin-ups a lot? One side effect I found is that my biceps grew like crazy. Meaning I wasn't doing any curls, I wasn't doing dumbbell curls, I wasn't doing like any super heavy curls, I was just doing that. And my biceps grew. And back when I was doing a ton of dips for my chest to build up my bench press, my triceps grew like crazy, which I showed me a few things. So for one, you want to do what I call the bicep chin-up. Now, I hope I have a video of this. If I'm not, sorry, but I'll just describe it right now. So what you want to do is you want to bring your hands as close as you can together on a bar. You want to pull yourself up just using your biceps. So I usually use a cue of drive your elbow to your ribs and back to really activate the lats, but you're not trying to do that. You just wanna work your biceps. So what you wanna do is bring your hands close together and then you want to just really focus on just like squeezing, contracting that bicep. And guys, if you get to the point where you can do this with a dip belt and you can put weight on it, you're going to feel it. You can actually go heavy on this movement, which means you're going to get that muscle building response or hormonal response and you're going to break down a ton of muscle. How awesome does that sound? Get one. These, that sounds pretty awesome. Now the other one I found is going to be dips. Now I know a lot of guys were like, oh my word, dips, hey, you can't do dips. Shut the fuck up, dudes. If you actually did dips right and taught them right, they wouldn't be bad. And if you injured your shoulder or whatever of doing a dip, well, you had other problems besides that dip. So dips is going to be amazing for you. But one thing you gotta realize is that Okay, if you really just have terrible shoulder problems and you're doing this, definitely do this instead, what I call a power bomb. Just because it reminds me of like Goku holding the spirit bomb up before he threw it right into Frieza. Yes guys, my name is Saint Lifestyle because I freaking love Dragon Ball Z. If you don't, get the hell off my channel. And so you wanna do this because it's really going to target the long head of your tricep. The long head of your tricep was where most of the meat of your tricep is. Like if you want guns that can hug the sleeves, like Robert Frank states, then you have got to get a long head of tricep. So it's going to give that horseshoe effect. So little tip you want to use to target the triceps more, make sure you're keeping your chest up. No more like folding over to really target your chest. Keep 
your chest up, and you're really going to feel this in your triceps. You're going to fry those triceps. So let me go over this again, guys. So one, you want to do the bicep chin up because you're going to be able to lift a ton of weight. Because, guys, how many guys can actually curl their body weight? I'll give you a, a, a good answer. Yeah, zero. Almost no guys can curl their body weight because almost physically it's just like, and oh, physics-wise, it's almost impossible to do that. So this is going to really hit your bicep, really break down a ton of muscle, which means that if you're recovering properly, you're going to have a lot of gains afterwards. You're going to see a lot of size and strength return. Now the dip is all because, well, not only is this going to help you increase your bench press, but it's also going to help hit that long head and really increase the meat on that section. And those are my two top exercises for the arms. Like if you guys only have like 20 minutes to hit the arms, do 10 minutes each on those and trust me, you're going to feel more than when you just did a bunch of curls and a bunch of push downs, which are bullshit. You're going to feel it. Now guys, if you do have any questions regarding like fitness, dating or self-improvement, go hit and follow my Instagram, link in the description down below. Do it right now. Guys, I really do want to help you. I'm getting to you as fast as I possibly can, which kind of depends on how busy the gym is right now. And well, also guys, subscribe for more content coming soon. I'm going to see all y'all Saiyans in the next video. Until then, Saiyans, let's kick some motherfucking ass. Later. Is to go even further beyond. Ah!